And Mike and Brandy, good morning. The concern is this week's storms could turn deadly. Two people in our area were already killed during the last storm. And take a look at this video just into our newsroom. A close call happened just after three this morning. There was a swift water rescue in El Dorado Hills at Sweetwater Creek. And this is video sent to us by the El Dorado Hills Fire Department. Crews say because of a heavy rain cell that moved through the area, a man who was camping became trapped in the middle of rapidly moving creek waters because of the flooding. He managed to call 911 and ended up climbing up a tree. After two hours of waiting, six swimmers were finally able to reach him. The victim was rescued and is said to be counting his blessings this morning. The individual was, was very thankful. He was not injured. He was obviously very cold um, and scared. And, uh, but other than that, he was extremely thankful that we went up to, uh, to get him from the tree, from the little, uh, which became like a little island. It kind of flooded around him as well. And Governor Gavin Newsom has activated the State Operations Center at Mather through Wednesday. First responders throughout California are working around the clock. They have been asked to staff up and to be ready to go to activate resources and crews that could save lives during this storm. Randy. Leticia, thanks so much. And during this week's expected storms, keep in mind you can call 311 anytime to get help or to ask questions. You can sign up for local alerts at calalerts.org. And you're asked, remember, to only call 911 if there is an actual critical emergency.